Can you imagine just driving your car into every wall and other car that you see and then getting mad that it has dents, right? That's what we're doing with our bodies. We're just driving it like into the ground. Your body is the one thing that's always been there with you and will never give up on you, will be there with you every day of your life. It is, it is absolutely the most loyal thing in your life is your body. And your body is reacting and responding to everything that you have done to it. It was born in good condition and then you took over. And so whatever has been going on with your health is a result of just how you've treated it. And so I knew when I recovered from lupus, um, I, I, I remembered that when I was younger, I thought my body turned against me. I was taught that was what lupus is. I was taught that lupus is when your immune system attacks yourself, your own body attacked itself. So it was like me, my personhood, my spirit against my body. And my body was gonna murder me, right? That's how I believed the disease to be. But when I healed, I realized, no, it's not true. My body fought back against everything I did to it. Chef Boyardee and macaroni and cheese and all the things that I did to it. My body suffered so much injury from it and yet held on. My kidneys were failing. All these things were happening because of what I did. I was not a friend to my body. I was abusing it and expecting it to just keep going in perfect condition. Can you imagine just driving your car into every wall and other car that you see and then getting mad that it has dents, right? That's what we're doing with our bodies. We're just driving it like into the ground. We're not putting any oil changes in. We're not doing anything to protect it. We're hitting bumpers. And then we're like, why does my car work like crap? That's what's happening. So when you start to take real care of your body, hypernourishment, true self-care, getting good night's sleep, handling your stress, your boundaries, all those things, now you are being a friend to your body. Instead of saying, you better show up in great condition no matter what I do to you, which is a really awful way to be, saying, I'm going to love you and nurture you and take care of you. That is being a friend to your body. So once I realized that it was the opposite, I was the abuser, my body was my loyal, loyal friend who was doing its best to keep me going in spite of everything I had done, and I took care of it instead, it thrived. And here I am at 45, still no health problems, right? Because now I'm a best friend to my body and she's a best friend back to me. So it's a really beautiful thing, I think, to get to the realization that your body is not your enemy, it is your most loyal friend, and you've been the abuser, but you can change. <laughs>